Hey guys, it's Thank Whatever back with another video. We're gonna react to an Emma Chamberlain video. It's the second newest video, but it's called Reacting to My Old Outfits. We're gonna see, I don't know. She usually doesn't like her old outfits or appearances from what I've seen in our other videos. How she doesn't like her, her like she calls herself cringy and hates herself when she was younger because of how like much she, that just shows how much she's grown as a person and, as, and the way her personality is, it's not the same as it was back then. And that's good because you know, you grow as a person and then you see back then, you're like, oh man, that was me, you know? But anyway, if you're new here, please subscribe, put on bell notifications, because I have a, a schedule now for Friday, Saturday, Sunday when I post videos, and that will be spread out or in one day of those days. And if I do post videos in between um, during the week, uh, you'll have to put on bell notifications, because I don't know if I will or not, because I'm pretty busy with college, but I'll try. So let's just get right into this video. Hey guys, welcome to my bed. Let's zoom it in. Let's zoom it in so we can see all of my forehead acne. <laughs> there it is. It's me and Declan here. Robot. We're ready to film a video. And I'm very nervous Heck for today's yes. video because it's going to be extremely embarrassing for me. And I'm aware of that. I'm going to be reacting to my old outfits. My style has come a long what? way. I love clothes. I love clothes. I've always loved clothes, but I used to have the worst style probably on planet Earth. Let's talk about it a little bit. <laughs> it deserves to be talked about because it's just that bad. Let's waste no time. Uh, let's get right into it. I talked about my style and my style evolution more in depth on my podcast, Anything Goes. The podcast episode is called Fashion. I, I talked about my podcast. fashion journey a little bit. Uh, also link in my description. And now that we're done plugging that, actually, let's plug one more thing. ChamberlainCoffee.com. <laughs> I need let's to try go. some Chamberlain Let's get right coffee. into it. Okay, so this first one, we're off to a great start. I feel like this is a <laughs> great representation of my middle school fashion. I don't know where I was. Couldn't tell you. I'm wearing a Hollister shirt that I actually got from the outlet, so I got a great deal on that. I remember I was so psyched. And then I am wearing... <laughs> The no, lowest like waisted Abercrombie just... shorts I've ever seen with the pockets sticking out. In retrospect, I don't even think I would wear shorts that short now. And then I'm wearing some flip flops that are too large for me. But I looked happy in the photo, so I mean, I must have been enjoying life at the time. <laughs> Who knows what's going on behind her smile. It looks, I wasn't wearing but still My hair is in a little has the same Something features. Never changed. Just a middle school bitch. Okay, next photo. <laughs> this was. <laughs> My eighth grade graduation. Oh my God, I hate it. I want to start at the shoes because the shoes are just so bad. They are earthy wedges that earthy? only third grade teachers should wear. Um, and I don't know why I was wearing them. I do remember them being very comfortable. So maybe I was onto something, but they're fucking hideous. I hate them. Now let's talk about the dress. So I'm wearing a little, I don't know where I got that dress from. It's pretty fucking boring. It's just a little white dress. I do look like I'm a flower girl at a wedding, or maybe I'm going to my first <laughs> I was like, gonna That sleep. is the energy I'm getting from this dress. I remember being so obsessed with it, though. I really thought I was onto something with this dress. I wasn't. I'm sorry, Emma. Moving on. Oh, no. Now we're in high school. I have a lot to say. I have a lot to high say. School. This is freshman year of high school. I am absolutely disgusted about <laughs> everything about this photo. Not only is my hair extremely yellow, because obviously wherever I was getting my yellow. hair dyed, they didn't know how to tone my hair properly. My teeth look really Oops. yellow. Not like they're not yellow now. For some reason, they look yellower here. I also was wearing time. black eyeliner on my upper lash line. It is too dark for me. It does not look good with my eye color. Don't know what I was thinking. I'm wearing a free people bralette, which was the thing freshman year. Everybody just wore the free people <laughs> halter bralettes under every outfit. Ow, Declan, stop. Oh my God, he just bit me. Why is he biting ah! me? I love you, but please stop. This top is just kind of like, it's like beachy. Like, I don't know what I was going for. I beachy. was trying to be a beachy girl. You know, because probably at this time I was trying to find a surfer boy boyfriend. Um, <laughs> it never worked out, but, but that doesn't even look like me. I don't even feel like that's me. I don't even remember who she is. It I don't looks a little bit. I think I want to know her, yeah. to be honest. Okay, so we're throwing it back a few years. Here I am. Is that Fred on her shirt? Wearing a Fred shirt. This is proof <laughs> that I have been a YouTube fan since day one. The hat and the oh scarf are on matching. If you zoom in to the neckline of my shirt, you can see that I'm wearing a cami underneath my shirt. That was what I wore when I was younger, and then as I grew up, I ended up growing into the free people bralettes. Next, we're going to be talking about one of my favorite Halloween costumes I've ever had which is my witch costume. The witch costume oh. from the outside looks cute and all, you know, pretty normal, but if you zoom into the details, things start to get oh, a little no. bit disturbing. Wearing... As you can see on my feet, I am wearing Speedo slides because at the time, 
I was in fact Speedo a swimmer, chunkers, and I had just come from swim okay. practice, so I was wearing my Speedo slides. And then if you go up to what I'm wearing on my top, uh, you can see peeking out from underneath a swimsuit. It was time to party. I didn't even want to take my swimsuit off. It was just immediately time to trick or treat. This is one of my favorite photos of all time. <laughs> is that a cat? I'm obsessed with this photo. I used to be obsessed with this cat costume. Obsessed with it, would never take it off. I looked so fucking cute in it. Look at her, she's just waving. She's just waving. She knows what she's doing. She knows what she's doing. Next photo is me. I'm oh, in Ireland. She's really and I am wearing a Rolling Stones shirt. At the time, I had Rolling never heard Stones. a Rolling Stones song. Adults were probably like, yeah. wow, what a cool kid. She listens to Rolling Stones. But in reality, I just was like, ooh, there's a bunch of tongues like, on the shirt. Looks that's cool. like most um, kids. I'm wearing some they wear band shirts that they never jeans. heard. Nothing about those are skinny. And again, I'm wearing some flip flops. I also don't know who the boy to my right is. I, I hate chunk those with friend, but I haven't jeans. seen him since I was 11, so I don't really know who he is, but I hope that he's doing well. But he looks like he was having a great time as well. He's wearing some sandals too, but his outfit actually makes <laughs> sense. My outfit doesn't make any sense. This next photo might be my worst outfit in history. Period. Mm -hmm. I am the wearing the same jeans I was wearing in the last photo. A sparkly blue Justice hoodie and oh, Justice. black my sister ballet used to flats. When she was Ballet flats? Who allowed me to wear this? Like, I'm almost angry at my mother. Why the ballet flats? <laughs> I can't even fucking look at it anymore. I'm literally, so I literally have to move it. on. So this next photo is when I started to find out what Brandy Melville was. I'm wearing a Brandy Melville top. It says, too sassy for you. Don't mess with her. I'm wearing a pair of Lululemon <laughs> leggings. Those are my first pair of Lululemon leggings. I thought it was the baddest bitch on the planet. This was just the definition of middle school for me. You know, it was just like leggings, trendy little tops, you know, from like Brandy and such, and like Hollister. This was also at the time <laughs> when I was obsessed with MagCon and Vine. That whole era oh, Vine, of my life was dude. just so confusing. And this outfit represents that. that. Fine represents on. So this next photo from. of me is when I was in high school. <laughs> the reason why I wanted to point this one out is because if you zoom in closely, I'm wearing a Vineyard Vines half zip. If you don't know what Vineyard Vines is, it's a very preppy brand. It's very preppy. I went yeah, to all those Catholic the whale? Schools, so a lot of the people there were very preppy. They were wearing Vineyard Vines, which is really expensive. I actually ended up finding yeah, this on Black Friday, and it was like 50% off, but then also another 50% off. So it was super cheap. Wow. So I caught that shit. <laughs> what? Came to school and was Number like, 50, I got Vineyard 50. Vines too now, guys. Ha <laughs> <laughs> But I used to wear that all the time because I felt so cool and preppy at my all-girls Catholic school. Crazy enough, this is freshman year of high school. I look 11. She looks like middle I look school. I look 11 year old. <laughs> and my outfit is not oh helping me in any way. I'm wearing a Brandy Melville rainbow top that everybody had. I'm wearing a denim jacket with a built-in sweatshirt under it. Again, everybody has built that. In. I was wearing black leggings and checkered vans. You could not wear a more predictable outfit. You just couldn't. <laughs> you know what I never bought just though? Couldn't. I never bought Adidas Superstars. I never bought Adidas Superstars and I fucking live by that. I never bought those and I am so proud of myself because I do not like those. And I'm sorry if you like them. It's totally fine, I'm not judging, but I hated <laughs> them. And everybody wore them except for me. I'm wearing some John Lennon sunglasses. I mean, I was trying to be vibey here. I was trying to be a little SF kid. Vibe I was trying to be vibey. Okay, so here was an vibe outfit that I was planning on wearing to a party. I remember I sent this photo to one of my friends and was like, should I wear this to the party? I'm wearing black shorts, black free people bralette, and a little tank top. Again, so fucking boring. Also, why does my <laughs> forehead look bigger there? This was me. I was going to a Giants game. Those jeans are- Giants game? way too tight. Okay, so camera. my camera died. I had had three <laughs> camera batteries and I lost two of them while I was on a trip. And so now I only have one what? battery and I have to make it last a whole video and it never ends up lasting. So that's what I've been dealing with recently. But anyways, let's get back to what we were talking about. This outfit actually would be cute for a Giants game if my jeans didn't look like they were painted onto my body. Next, <laughs> we have one of my Halloween costumes. I was a lifeguard. I just don't understand why my shorts are so small. Oh my god. I actually know for a fact that I had gotten these shorts for like my 12th birthday, 13th birthday. Oh my god, I found the photo. I found the photo of me wearing these shorts when I was like 10. As you can see, uh, if you zoom into my neck, the Free People bralette is making another appearance. It has been three hours because I needed to let my one battery charge because it kept dying. But I'm so determined to finish raiding these outfits that 
I decided I was not gonna wait until tomorrow, and I was going to do it right now. Watch my battery die again, knowing my look. Okay, so the next one is me. I think it was New Year's Eve. Uh, I was planning on going to a New Year's Eve party, I remember. Uh, but then we didn't end up getting invited to any. My jeans, they're just so boring. Why did I even buy those? How did I go to the store and say, ooh, I wanna buy those? At least they weren't <laughs> low-waisted jeans. They're a little bit, they're like mid-waisted. So they're not fully low-waisted. So that's like at least an improvement. So this next outfit is actually my formal dress. You know, the shoes are actually kinda cute. I remember they're like navy blue velvet. The dress is, they always give me with that. I remember I borrowed dude. it from somebody, um, which the, was very sweet of them to let me borrow it because I was desperate the to wear the dress. But it was like stained yellow at the bottom, which uh. you can kind of see in the photo, <laughs> but I just wore it anyway. The dress just sucks. I feel like it just doesn't fit my body properly. I don't know, I'm over it, moving on. Oh, this one's fun. I had this phase in like seventh and eighth grade. I would go home from school <laughs> and I'd put on Old Navy pajama pants. I would wear them in public everywhere. And then, you know, I can't really see what my hoodie has on it, but I'm assuming it has palm trees and a sunset kind of vibe. That's what I'm, I think that's what that She's was. Like... Ugly. Also, what the fuck am I doing? Why am I posing like that? Imagine holding a baby for nine months and it coming out of the womb <laughs> and then doing that pose. Must have been so disappointing for my mom. Okay, this next one, I hate this. I hate this outfit. There's actually two photos. So it's this one and then this one. Mm. So these two photos go together. Uh -oh. um, we'll talk about the first photo first. I am wearing white Vans, Lululemon leggings, a gray crew neck sweatshirt, and a North Face vest that was the smallest size, but because I was literally so short, it was like a dress on me. It was way too long. <laughs> and then I am wearing Ray-Bans that were a gift from my dad that were matching with his Ray-Bans, which in retrospect is very cute, although they were not the best shape for my face, which you will see in the next photo. But you know what, because they were a gift from my dad and I really liked them at the time, it's kind of a wholesome story, can't really roast it. And then as you can see in this next photo, the glasses were just not meant for my face. But at the time I loved them. And so we're not gonna say anything mean, okay? This next photo is okay. so fucking cute. You know how everybody always makes fun of kids who karate. do karate? Imagine making fun of her. It's precious. <laughs> she looks amazing. I mean, she looks like she kicks some ass. She rocks the karate outfit like it's like it's runway fashion. I fucking love her. <laughs> I wish that I could be friends with her. Oh uh. my god. This next This is the best outfit I've ever worn. Period. No <laughs> shoes. Cargo pants. White button up. Short sleeve shirt with a hood. <laughs> fucking savage. Glasses, Set. hair half up, half down, hand in the fucking oh shotgun. This God. bitch does not care about you. She doesn't care about anyone. She doesn't care about me, and I am her. I can't believe I'm her. <laughs> Holy shit, I can't stop thinking about it. I think we need to move on. I need to post that on my Instagram. Okay, anyways, moving on. This was me during my glamorous stage. I <laughs> was honestly living my best life. I had a velvet pink night dress, a silky purple, Sleeve mask. I was smiling. My hair okay. was blonde naturally. Fucking amazing outfit. So glamorous. She wasn't even going in public. She was just going to sleep and she looks like that. And then oh. things took a Natural blonde? What Is the fuck? What, what the fuck oh, am I God. wearing? <laughs> Polka dot flip flops, red sweatshorts, and a blue oh zip God. up. Like, I don't get it. I mean, now I wear sweatshorts, so I guess I can't really give myself shit. None of it matches. Where the fuck was I? Now I present to you my first day of fifth grade. Um, as you can see, I'm by my locker which I had decorated way too intensely. There was no reason to decorate my locker with that much detail. I was so excited to have a fucking locker that I literally spent hours on this locker. If you look hours. at the bottom of the locker, we took little samples from Home Depot and we glued them onto um, a piece of like cardboard and so that <laughs> it would look like I had wood at the bottom of my locker. Let's look at the outfit. The same wow, Abercrombie okay. shorts we've seen already today once. A white cami underneath a Charlotte Russe striped cropped top. Crop tops were my thing back then. I hate everything about it. Let's move on. We're moving on to now my first day of high school. <laughs> so, oh, I know what a lot of you may be thinking. 
Emma, there's no way you were a high schooler in this photo. Well, I was, and you were probably also wondering why my hair was so long. I'm asking myself the same thing. I also had an ankle brace on for an unknown reason. I don't know what happened to my ankle. Her skin looks amazing. It was a double-edged sword. She looks like she's seven, but she also looks kind of great. Oh my God, and that's our last photo. Well, gosh darn it. Mm. Hope you had fun going down memory gosh, lane darn. with me, fashion memory lane. I'm glad to say that things have gotten a lot better since. Yeah, again, I hope you guys are staying safe and taking care of yourselves, and hopefully you smiled a little bit today. Maybe you had a good laugh. I love you all. Yeah, was, Peace and love. And don't forget, everybody has some bad fashion mistakes. It's all about how you improve as you grow. <laughs> she good. That's yeah. Beautiful. You're welcome. Also, if anybody knows how to Thank get you. rid of this acne quickly, I'm literally doing everything I can. I'm literally on Accutane. Accutane is the strongest acne medication you can take, and yet I'm three months in and I still have terrible acne. Help me get rid of it. If you guys have any products that I can use, let me know. Just save me. Save me from this. <laughs> I don't know, dude. I don't have any treatments. Anyways, that was that was funny. And like I said at the beginning, I guess that was basically what she had said here at the end. Was like, you know, you grow as a person. You have different styles. So yeah. Anyway, guys, thank you for thank you for coming by and watching my reaction to that. Um, I hope you stick around. Please subscribe. Put on bell notifications when I post new videos. And yeah, stay safe. Stay healthy. Stay inside. I'll see you guys later. Peace out. Bye.